And your eye on health, melanoma is taking the lives of black men more than any other group of people. That's according to a study from the American Academy of Dermatology. Our Kennedy Walker joins us live in studio to explain why this seems to be the case. Good morning, Kennedy. Good morning, Brooke and Keith. Melanoma is the most aggressive and deadliest type of skin cancer. And while the CDC says white men are more likely to get melanoma, the study found that black men are 26% more likely to die from the disease. The cancer was found in unexpected places such as the bottom of the feet, hands, and fingernails. The study does not give a clear answer as to why, but it did find that men were less likely to go to the doctor than women and that black men were less likely to have private insurance. Dermatologist Dr. Rebecca Vasquez, who did not participate in the study, but she said that examining yourself and getting diagnosed early could be the key to saving your life. Unfortunately, for a lot of melanomas, uh, especially uh, in, in communities, in, in Black individuals, Hispanics, it can sometimes mimic a normal-looking mole, but it's changing. And they're like, well, I've had it all my, all my life. I hear it all the time. I've had it my entire life, but it started changing, but I didn't think anything of it because I had been told it looked okay. But if things are evolving and changing, you know, um, that, that, that needs to be addressed. Now, according to the American Cancer Society, for most types of cancers, black people have the highest death rate and the shortest survival rate of any other race. The same is true for melanoma. The estimated five-year survival rate for black patients is only 70% versus 94% for white patients. Kennedy, uh, something for everyone to keep in mind, especially the groups of people that it affects the most. Kennedy, thank you. Very informative.